Hey guys, it's your boy Midwest EDH. Today's gonna be a more serious video where I'm not going to do a lot of jokes because I'm gonna do something that I've, you know, kind of promised myself I'm not gonna like try to be like uh, political or anything, but I'm actually very mad at this. So Therese Nielsen uh, recently was let go by Wizards of the Coast and for the crime of liking some, uh, following some people on uh, Twitter, I think that's a horrible choice for Wizards of the Coast. Um, just because you follow someone doesn't mean you like them. And I think that firing a very iconic artist like Therese Nielsen, I really do love her work. You know, she's done some amazing work. She did uh, the Liliana versus Garuk, uh, Garuk artwork. That looks really freaking great. I'm going to have that card right here. It looks stupendous. Let's not even just... The Guru Lands, Force of Will, like, the Swords to Plowshears. Her artwork for Swords to Plowshears is in every single one of my Commander decks because her artwork is phenomenal. When you think of Magic the Gathering artists, you think of, like, five people, okay? You think of Therese Nielsen, you think of John Avon, you think of Mark Poole, you think of Rebecca Gway, and you think of Seb McKinnon now. You know, so you think of those people. Did I say... Yeah, I did say John Avon. And, you know, losing a huge pillar like that in the Magic the Gathering artwork... In the Magic the Gathering art world kind of sucks. Like, the one thing that I don't like about recent Magic, and I hate... If you're going to, like, negative bomb this, I understand, guys. And I promise I won't do another video like this because I do not... This channel is a hobby, you know, I, I want people to have fun. I decided to make this channel because of Corona and I can't go out and, you know, hang out with my magic group. I can't play magic at my local game store, you know, that it, it, it just kind of sucks. But losing a really good artist like that is both disheartening and, and sad, like, I, I play magic with people I don't agree with on a lot of things, and that's 100% okay. We bond because we love the game. We bond because we like magic. You know, this is my problem with today. We don't find common ground anymore. We just, you know, I don't like you, therefore you are bad. You know, instead of just going, you know, I like ice cream. Well, I like ice cream too. Well, okay, well, we got something. We got something. Let's sit down. Let's play some magic and eat ice cream. I think at the end of the day, guys, I just really want to eat ice cream. You know, but I think, uh, I think those are my thoughts. And I hope you guys like this video. If you don't like this video, man, I understand. You know, some people just want to hear me, you know, be a fucking weirdo and talk about like you know the stupid things or like get fucking blasted in the face with a confetti cannon which okay they're like uh 250 at walgreens guys and like if it wasn't for the fact that it took me like an hour and a half to clean all the confetti in my house i would be firing confetti videos every freaking video i'm really tempted to buying more anyways um that's your Midwestern goodbye. Um, I'm sorry for this video being uh, not so funny. You know, I'm not even going to do my edgy boy intro um, because I I don't think that this is the character of Kyle. You get real Kyle right now. So I hope you guys enjoy that. And if you don't like this, um, that's okay. And... You guys have a special day, and I thank all my subscribers for, you know, sticking with me. Like, you know, we're Team Midwest EDH. We eat freaking green bean casserole, uh, drink beer, and talk about the Packers. I don't know anything about football, guys. I'm sorry. But go Pack Go!